Okay, fellas, if you're tired of feeling the same, and if you're tired of being in the same state of mind and in the same state of habits, please keep watching this video because I'm going to tell you guys five different things that I am changing differently in 2023, which the title of this video is five things to do in 2023 that will make you a better person. Um, not only a better person, but better mentally and spiritually. So I'm just going to get right to it because I came up with these like weeks ago in order to really optimize my um, upcoming year as a student, as a mom, as a boxer, and as a future nurse. So I wanted to tell you guys the things that I'm doing in order to make you a happier person, make you healthier, make you more spiritual as well as mentally able to handle what life has to, thro to throw at you. So I'm going to give you guys five different habits and if you stick around towards the end, I'm pretty much going to summarize um, you know, my thoughts on these different habits and how I think they will have an impact. And like I said, I'm going to get right to it. So I have a little notepad here. Bear in mind, um, I am sick. I got a little bit sick from my baby. So bear with me with my voice. And um, I'm going to make a quick, a few pauses here and there because I just need to like um, reset. But first one is change your mind. And the only way that you will change your mind is knowing that it will change your life. So if there's a saying called change your mind, change your life for a reason because if you are in the mindset of negative beliefs, um, negativity, having fear about the future or having fear that something will happen to you or something will happen to this person or another person in your life, then we need to start being a little bit more aware of that and changing it slowly because it won't, changing your mindset won't be something that happens overnight. It's something that gets accumulated. It's something that you, have to put um work and time for just like how people go to the gym that's exactly what we're doing for our mind i'm a huge believer in my philosophy is that you also need to train your mind obviously not just your body because our mind is a muscle and um a muscle needs learning a muscle needs memory a muscle needs um to capture information and to be able to change and grow so the first one is changing your mind and being aware of your thoughts and if you are you know first time into um, personal development or trying to better yourself trying to be more than what you are then I suggest getting a little notepad like this um, you can just get them at Walmart they're a dollar or two but um, I find that they're very helpful for me I keep them in my bag I keep them in my backpack I keep them in my gym bag and I like to just note down little things that I you know think about throughout the day for example if i have a negative thought then i'll be like you know as cheesy as it sounds this definitely won't serve me or my future or my goals so if it's not serving you if it's a thought that is not serving you if it's a feeling that is not serving you i suggest to really just note it down and try to make a note of it and say hey next time i am gonna have a winner's mindset i'm gonna have a more positive mindset and i promise your life will start to change for the better um, and a lot of this information may a little uh, may be a little bit hard just because I'm also learning to take responsibility for my actions and things that I do and the things I feel and think. So I suggest, you know, for you, someone that's trying to improve and be someone better, I suggest to also take that into account to, you know, be responsible for your feelings and um, your thoughts and being able to be conscious and aware of them. So... Sorry guys, um, I did catch a little cold. So um, the second tip is drink more water. Um, I should have my water here with me, but I'm recording my video now. But um, just please drink more water. We need water. It's our fuel for our organs and our system and it clears our liver. Just everything in your body aligns when you have water. We need water every day um, to survive. Our cells need water, our body is made up of water, so that's an indicator that we obviously need it. But um, if you have just a, a water bottle or something near you, or right in the morning when you wake up, have a sip of water, have a cup of water, um, even with lemon. I like to put lemon in my water because it, um, it's an antioxidant and it really um, kind of helps the, uh, my digestive system to start moving around and start accepting my actual breakfast. So water, guys, water. 
Um, it helps your skin, it helps your hair, your nails, everything, your energy, your mood. And like I want to start saying is that your health is wealth. So if you feel better, you will feel better to make more money. If you feel better, you will feel better to take care of your daughter, etc. So the third point here is, I know this is hard because I've said in my last social media video, um, you can click on my channel and look for that video, but um, having a phone in the morning right away is kind of like, you know, I guess a toddler watching TV all day. It's, it sounds crazy, right? But in the morning when we wake up, our brain starts producing serotonin, which is a happy chemical in the body. And the more that we ease into the day with no distractions, no someone, you getting a bad message or you getting something in your text messages that you didn't want to see, that's pretty much going to be the sum of your day. And I've experienced this personally because the way that I would wake up in high school is by listening to music right away or listening to rap or listening to, you know, all right guys, sorry about that random cut, but I was talking about um, the rapping, the rapping music, and I would listen to that and I wouldn't be able to wake up in a bright state of mood. I would kind of just think about what I heard in the song or something that kind of stuck with my brain subconsciously. But to conclude with my fifth tip, I just, it's something that I've been also trying to apply more because it's very easy for me to just work on my computer for hours, um, you know, doing homework or looking up stuff for nursing. But um, the last one is um, getting blue light blockers and you can buy them on Amazon, they're like $15. And um, blue light will mess with your sleep. And I've probably experienced this in the past just because I would, obviously sleep with the tv on and i would sleep with netflix on i would sleep with all of the light that was probably in my home and my sleep suffered badly and i would feel so tired in the morning i wouldn't have energy then i would kind of jump over to me not performing so well in school and getting bad grades yes getting bad grades because i didn't get the best sleep and why because blue light is telling your body to stay awake when our bodies are trying to produce the hormone melatonin which helps you sleep and i'm gonna stay in this background it's so awesome but um yeah so we can't sleep because of the blue light and something that i've started doing recently is i purchased some blue light blockers and it's kind of already been a couple days of me using them and i already feel the amounts of energy and the amount of um melatonin that gets produced at night obviously i can't feel it physically but i do start noticing i get you know tired right about at the same time which is important for your body to stay in a crowd um in kind of like a sequence of sleep patterns and sleep times in order for your body to naturally produce the hormones that we need to protect ourselves and to sleep and get well rest and yeah so those are the things that i'm going to start doing differently in 2023 and I hope that whoever is watching this, if it's one person, zero people, who cares? I just want to plant the seed out there and I want to let people know that this channel is basically going to be about pure growth and everything that comes with it. You know, if you're a boxer, keep on watching, keep, keep coming back to my YouTube channel because I am a boxer and I'm a nursing student. And I just want to make this video for people who are in the same interests and who are also trying to improve their mind, which sounds silly, right? Who, who wouldn't want to improve their mind? But I hope you guys have a beautiful and a freaking great start to your 2023 because this year is ours and it's a year to make change, not with ourselves, but with everything else, you know? Just rise above, be great, be better than you were yesterday. That's That's what it's about. So thank you so much, guys, and I'll see you in the next.